So I am at eight Hall of Fame trophies. You'll get your shot. Oh. Only for three shows? That sucks, actually. Oh. I like that, actually. I am really fucking close to this. Uh, let's say I'm at 18 mil. Literally, I just need to win the season and then get that. And I'm good. I might get, be able to get this one too. I might be able to get 11 trophies. Yeah, I, I think this might be the last season. So yeah. 59,500 for 7.2... Damn. I just keep gaining so many fans. Okay. Who's wrestling this week? We can have Dexter Luma's face off against somebody. Uh, we can have them fight. Boogeyman and Roddy Roddy Piper for the uh, end match. The main event match. Eos Guy and Dewdrop can fight. Who else do we have? I don't want them to fight because that's fucking stupid ass rivalry. Becky hasn't had a match in a while. And Indy, their rivalry cooldown is over. Um, I can just throw them in a match. Throw them in a submission match and have that just be done. Who can he go after? He does need to go after a fighter, so let's have Damien Priest do a role change. Dexter Loomis do some advertising. Okay, I have one special match type, no run-ins. Yeah. I'll save that for now. Yeah, let's keep going. 223k for the cost of the show. Should get a lot more than that. So we have Eosky versus Dewdrop. Dewdrop gets her win back. No rivalry change. Cena calls out Damien pretty successfully. Becky Lynch versus Indy for the NXT women's title. Becky wins. They get a rivalry. Oh, Becky's new champ. I just realized that. Damian Priest is successfully a heel. We got Fleming Stones versus Chester in a submission match. And Fleming Stones is the winner. And that completes the rivalry. We have Dexter Loomis doing an advertising promo for 20k. Losing only one popularity in the process. Then we have Rowdy Rowdy Piper versus... <laughs> He's coming to get you. One, two, ring the bell. And the big man wins. And they get to level four. We got Bowship Brittany versus Trixie Gambit. Two, ring the bell. And Bowship Brittany wins. We got Drew McIntyre calling out Champa for a level one rivalry. We got Lesnar versus DiBiase. Lesnar wins. And gets injured for four weeks. Rhea Ripley does a self promo for nothing. British Bulldog versus MVP. 
MVP wins. Talia does a charity promo for 3750 fans. And we have Cedric Alexander versus Shanky in an Iron Man match. And Shanky wins. And the rivalry goes level 2. We got Candice LeRae versus Bianca Belair. Candice LeRae wins. We got Heath Manhattan doing a self promo for nothing. We have Ivar and Shinsuke Nakamura versus Masse and Braun Breaker. Two of the people in this match have very low stamina. Shinsuke and Ivar win. They get a rivalry. Shinsuke is injured for three weeks. Charlotte Flair does, calls out Carolina Reaper for nothing. And then we have Jerry the King Lawler and Seth Rollins versus Johnny Gargano and Commander Aziz. One, two, that's three. Bring it. And the tag team champions, Johnny Gargano and Commander Aziz, retain. Or they get they win. They didn't put the title on mine. Uh, Kane does a self promo for three popularity. And then Apollo Crews versus Kevin Nash in a backstage One, brawl. Two, it's over. Bring it. And Apollo Crews wins. Uh, Eddie ver and Ilya versus T-Bar and Miz. Uh, Eddie and, T and Ilya win. Zoe Stark does a self-promo for five popularity. Braun Showman versus Jimmy Uso. Jimmy Uso wins. We have Bailey doing a self-promo for three popularity. We have Julius Creed versus Randy Orton. Julius Creed wins. And they get a rivalry. Ali Brawler does a self promo for two popularity, and Maya Kirk versus Asuka in a tables match. Asuka wins. They get a level three rivalry out of that. So we got one injury on SmackDown, one on Raw, and none on WCW. And I got 200k. I have 300,000 fans more than SmackDown. 305,000 and some change. Okay, I'll give you some more money, I guess. Never mind. Never mind. That's a lot of fucking money. That's a lot of fucking money. I don't care. I, I just finished the rivalry, didn't I? Okay, so Ready Ready Piper wants to team up with Cena. Okay. Then Indy wants her rematch. And don't book my most popular fighter. Don't book Loomis. Got it. So we have... Cena and Rowdy versus uh, Priest and Boogie. Man. Okay. Interesting match. Um, I can just have Eric versus Logan Paul. Have that be a match. Have Omos versus Dom be a match. Hopefully... That will break their rivalry. Uh, I can just do advertisings. Jesus, they got so popular. They got so popular for no fucking reason. I'll use that next week on whoever I think deserves it. Uh, 
I don't have any rivalries on here, do I? I have one rivalry on here. They can do a better match. And they can definitely do a better match. I don't want to do them. I don't want to have them be in a special match type. Uh, let's put someone other than Damien Priest in here. Let's put... Let's put Vader in here, then have Damien Priest run in on Cena. Hopefully that keeps the tag team rivalry from happening. Okay, so we have Red Rider Piper and Cena, requested by Red Rider Piper, versus Vader and Boogeyman, with Damien Priest running on Cena. Vader and Boogeyman win. No rivalry changes, so that's good. Uh, Dexter Lewis gets me 20k. Logan Paul versus Eric inside of a steel cage. Logan Paul wins. Chester gets me 17k before he leaves. Omos versus Dominic Mysterio inside of a steel cage. It's not going to get rivalry, is it? Oh, it does get a rivalry. Okay. We got a level one rivalry. Almost from Mysterio. And then we have Flintmick Stones. Giving me six giving me 17k before he leaves as well. And then we have Becky Lynch versus Indy Hartwell for the NXT women's title. And Becky Lynch retains. Their rivalry grows to level two. We have Trixie Gambit and versus Natalia in a tables match. Natalia wins. We have the returning Finn Balor facing off against MVP inside of an Iron Man match. Not inside, in an Iron Man match. And Finn Balor wins his comeback match. Cedric Alexander is facing off against British Bulldog. And British Bulldog wins. And gets injured for four weeks. Then we have the main event. Rhea Ripley versus Gigi Dolan versus Battleship Brittany. In Hell in a Cell. Bowship Brittany wins. And is the new SmackDown Women's Champion. And then we got Raw. Candice LeRae versus Bianca Belair. One, two, that's three. Bell. Bianca wins. Masse calls out Kevin Nash for nothing. Ron Breaker versus Heath Manhattan. One, two. Ring that bell. Ron Breaker wins and is injured for five weeks. Kane does a self promo for three popularity. Commander Aziz and Johnny Gargano, the Raw Tag Team Champions, are facing off against Angel and Jerry the King Lawler. One, two. That's three. Ring the and the Tag Team Champions win. Then we have Ivar doing a charity promo for 1500 fans. We have Apollo Crews versus Kevin Nash in an Iron Man match. One, and Kevin Nash wins. Then we got Randy Orton versus Julius Creedon in the Iron Man match. One, two, CBU really does like these Iron Man matches, and that was a draw. And the rivalry grows. We have The Miz doing a charity promo for 6750 fans. We have Zoe Stark versus Ali Brawler. Two, Zoe Stark wins. And gets injured for five weeks. We have Ilya Dragunov doing a self-promo for nothing. We have Eddie versus T-Bar with Braun Strowman running in on T-Bar. And Eddie wins. We have Bailey doing a self-promo for poor popularity. And then we have Asuka versus Maya Kirk in a tables match for the main event. And Asuka wins. The rivalry goes to level 4. Okay. SmackDown did not get any rivalries. Raw did not get any rivalries. And... WCW has level 4 rivalry. So there's one injury on Raw. 
one on WCW, and one on SmackDown. And Cena and Roddy are a good uh, tag team. And I have one and a half million. Wait, who actually has more money? Me or Raw? Uh, Raw does by 7k. Yep. You're welcome. Yep, you got your title rematch. You're welcome. I thought Damian Priest got a chance at it. Well, he's getting a chance at it now. A fatal four-way match. Um... Are they my only other rivalry? Okay, I have another rivalry too. Okay, there we go. That's your chance to the NXT title. Um, do drop an EO, Becky and Indy. Well, I'm gonna get the next crew in special effects, but I'm not going to get the last ones for them or the advertisings. It's kind of sad, but oh well. God, that's getting so close to the end of the bar. I'm definitely going to get 20 mil by the time the uh, season's over. Considering I'm getting like 200k each uh, week, no shot I don't. And this is week 13, so I'm going to use Best Friends Forever on WCW. And then I can use both of those next week on whoever I deem fit. Damn. I have a lot of good popularity people. Uh, Otis is my lowest popularity person. Wow. We got Dexter doing another advertising for us. Uh, let's get Vader and Rob doing advertising for us. Both of them have force. So that should be good enough. Yep. So, job the matchup, we got Becky Lynch versus Indy Hartwell for the NXT Women's Championship. And Becky retains. Rivalry grows to three. We have Dexter Lumis doing advertising for us, getting us 20k for nothing. We got EO Sky versus Dewdrop. And Dewdrop wins again. Rivalry grows to level three. We got Vader. Getting a 17k for a 3 popularity loss. We got Omos versus Dominic Mysterio. One, two, ring the bell. And Omos wins. Their rivalry goes level 2. We got RVD getting me 15k for 6 popularity loss. And then we have Cena versus Damian Priest versus Roddy Roddy Piper versus the Boogeyman. A fatal 4-way match for the NXT title. And the Boogeyman is the new NXT Champion. We have X-Pac versus Matt Riddle in an Extreme Rules match. Matt Riddle wins. They get a level 4 rivalry. We have MVP doing a self promo for one popularity. We have Shanky and Drew McIntyre versus Ted DiBiase and Tommaso Ciampa. Them and Drew and Shanky win. We have Cedric Alexander doing a self promo for nothing. We have Natalia versus Gigi Dolan. One, two, and Gigi Dolan wins. They get a level 2 rivalry out of that. Finn Balor calls out the British Bulldog for level 3 rivalry. 
And then Trixie Gambit vs. Battleship Brittany in an Iron Woman match for SmackDown Women's Championship. And Battleship Brittany retains the championship. We have a Raw Tag Team Titles match between Johnny Gargano and Commander Aziz, the current champions, and Seth Frickin' Rollins and Jerry the King Lawler. And the current champions retain. Andre the Giant calls out uh, Apollo Crews for level 1 rivalry. Umaga versus Heath Manhattan in an Iron Man match. Heath Manhattan wins. Cancer Raid is a charity promo for 6k fans. Kane versus Angel. Angel wins. They get a rivalry. Bella does a self promo for nothing. Then we have Veer Mahan versus Rey Mysterio for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. And Veer Mahan retains and gets injured for two weeks. Then we have Julius Creed versus Randy Orton to open up WCW. Their rivalry grows to level 3. Bailey does a self promo for 4 popularity. Braun Strowman vs. Jimmy Uso vs. Eddie Guerrero. Triple threat match. And Braun Strowman wins. We have Ali Brawler vs. Asuka. Ali Brawler wins. And they get to level 1 rivalry out of that. We got T-Bar and The Miz vs. Ilya Dragunov and Cody Rhodes. And an Extreme Rules tag match. One, two, ring it. And The Miz and T-Bar win. It looks like... I can't really tell who is the... I mean... Probably WCW, actually. So I have level 3, level 3, level 2, and no changes. Other than the Boogeyman winning the title. We got no injuries. One injury on Raw. And none on WCW. So one injury on Raw. 281k. X Puck has a great feel for Extreme Rules matches. And I am the richest by almost 200k. And I am 300,000 fans ahead of SmackDown. Basically, it's a little bit less than 300k, but. Yep, I keep my word. You want 50k? I'll give you 50k. Schedule a run in on one of my champions this week. Well, SmackDown, your biggest star is not going to be there, and it's going to cost you double. I can get pretty much any superstar I want. I'm going to sign AJ Styles and Robert Roode. And... Damn, they dropped Maya Kirk. And... That's going to be it for now. But... They are going to be on the show tonight. Um, AJ, Robert Rude, they're gonna wrestle each other. Gonna have the, uh, what is that, like the eighth match that they've had?
eighth match, at least the like ninth or tenth match that they've had. Mm. And they're gonna have a steel cage match. <clears throat> and I don't really need to state what I'm doing here because uh, I've done the same thing for weeks now. Just constant advertisings. Uh, and there we go. And that's my show. We got Becky Lynch vs. Indy Hartwell for the NXT Women's Title. And Becky retains again. The rivalry goes to level 4. We have seen it calling out Damian Priest for level 2 rivalry. We have Eosky vs. Dewdrop. Come on level 4. Come on level 4. And they do not get to level 4. We have Damian Priest calling out John Cena for level 3 rivalry. And we have AJ Styles vs. Robert Roode. AJ Styles wins and they get a rivalry. We have Dexter Lumis doing advertising getting me 21k. Then we have Omos versus Dominic Mysterio inside of a steel cage. And Dom wins. With no rivalry change. We have Natalia versus Gigi Dolan. Natalia wins. They go to level 3. Tracy Gambit gets 6k fans. Rhea Ripley versus Cora Jade. Rhea wins. Battleship Brittany calls out Trixie Gambit for nothing. And then we have the SmackDown Tag Team Champions, Tommaso Ciampa and Teddy, Ted DiBiase versus Drew McIntyre and Shanky. Not for the tiles or anything, just normal tag match. Drew McIntyre and Shanky win. We have MVP doing a self-promo for 2 popularity. Then we have Matt Riddle versus X-Pac. And Matt Riddle wins. Then on Raw, we have an Iron Man match between Apollo Crews and Andre the Giant. Apollo Crews wins. They get up to level 2 rivalry, and Andre the Giant is injured for 3 weeks. Umaga does a self promo for nothing. Rey Mysterio versus the, the Red Flame. Rey wins. They get a rivalry. Seth Rollins does a self promo for nothing. Commander Aziz and Angel do have a match. One, two, ring the bell. Angel wins and Commander Aziz is injured for two weeks. Caroline Reaper calls out Charlotte for nothing. And Bianca versus Candice LeRae. One, two, it's over. Candice LeRae wins. Asuka vs. Ali Brawler for the women's title, the WCW women's title. Asuka wins and is the new champion. Level 2 rivalry. Bailey does a self promo for 4 popularity. We got The Miz and T Bar vs. Eddie Guerrero and Ilya Dragunov with Braun Strowman running on somebody. I'm assuming probably T Bar because that's how WCW's been doing their booking. We have Jimmy Uso and Cody Rhodes. Cody Rhodes wins. Then we have Julius Creed versus Randy Orton in a backstage brawl. And Julius Creed wins. They get a level 3 rivalry. So I have a level 4 and a level 3. And a level 2. Nothing big really in SmackDown either. Andre the Giant gets injured and Commander Aziz gets injured, so that's two for Raw. Two injuries for Raw, I should say. Then, none for any other company. I got 201,000.
I am in the lead in money and fans. And we're at Survivor Series. Oh no, my power cards cost double. Ooh, that's actually big. Becky Lynch is out for this week. And Becky Lynch has already been vetoed. So. And I am not going to renew RVD or Piper or Boogeyman or Vader. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Here's 100k. Sure. You versus Eric will happen soon. I'm not having Damien Priest cut a promo, even though that's a great reward. Because that's going to be the main event match. Uh, not the main event. The opener. The main event is going to be them two for the title. Sure. Last man standing, I guess. Last woman standing match. That does kind of fuck up my entire thing that I was doing, but it's fine. I can do a Fatal 4-Way Steel Cage match. AJ Styles and Robert Roode and... Dexter Loomis and Eric. Or... Yeah. And then... I'm just gonna do advertising. Still. Try to get that last little push that I need. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yep, I get the new the new crew booking. Oh, I can do a submission match for this. Yeah, I'm just gonna do a submission match for this. Ah, there we go. Also, I have so many pre-match physios that I'm not gonna be using because there's no point in that. Okay. That looks good. I'm glad that, uh, Cena lost some popularity. Uh, what do I? I'm, mm, I guess I can watch the uh, Fatal Four Way Steel Cage match. So we got Cena versus Damian Priest in the Last Man Standing match for the NXT North American Title, and Cena is the new NXT North American Champion. Vader gives me fourteen K before he goes out the door. Omos versus Dominic Mysterio in a last man standing match. One, two, ring the bell. Dominic wins. The rubber grows level 3. RBD gets me 13k before he goes out the door. EO Sky versus Dewdrop. EO Sky wins. Oh, that was also in a last man standing match. Carmella gets me 10k. AJ Styles versus Robert Roode versus Dexter Loomis versus Eric. Inside of a steel cage.
Okay, everyone in there? Everyone's in there. Cage is down. We got Styles and Loomis facing each other. We got Rude and Eric facing each other. Rude went for a very early pin there. I wonder if you can break the cage. Dexter Loomis not able to get up for it. AJ Styles does a power bomb to him. AJ Styles and Eric facing off against each other now. Robert Roode and Dexter facing off. This is a little bit too chaotic for me to follow, I'm gonna be honest. Oh. Eric goes into the cage and over the rope. Dexter gets thrown over the top rope. Gets thrown onto the top rope, sorry. Robert Reed breaks up AJ Styles' pin on Eric. And then AJ throws Robert Reed into the turnbuckle. Dexter Lumis put AJ Styles in the submission hole and got broke out of because of two people's interference. Robert Reed is technically in the lead, I believe. Eric and Dexter Loomis both have orange body parts. Eric is out of green stamina. And Eric looks like he is starting to lose some max stamina. Eric with a red chest piece. Kicks out at one. AJ Styles has Dexter Loomis, but Robert Roode breaks it up. Then Robert Roode puts AJ in. And then Eric breaks it up. Got Eric and Dexter again. Dexter and Roode again. Ooh. Damn, looks like Dexter Loomis is bleeding. Eric goes for the pin, but immediately gets broken up by Dexter Loomis. Pressure on Dexter Loomis. And Eric keeps missing the breakup. But it doesn't matter because Dexter Loomis kicked out. Dexter Loomis made it so that Eric can't climb up. Power bombs him. Robert Roode looks like he still has the least amount of damage to him. There's just so much going on at one time in this match. Now imagine if we were able to actually have a full-on War Games match. Suplex. 
imagine just doing a uh, cross promotion uh, Survivor Series War Games match. I'd have these four against four from another company. Damn. Looks like AJ Styles might be uh, leading now. Oh. Dexter's at the top. Eric takes AJ Styles down. Robert Roode's trying to take down Dexter. And he at least drags Eric, uh, Dexter down from the top. And AJ almost gets pinned by Eric. Robert Roode is up at the top. AJ is getting stopped from getting Robert Roode down. I think Robert Roode's going to get down because Eric stopped AJ from stopping him. And Robert Roode wins. Wow. Just wow. And that was only a three and a half star match. Well, at least that grew uh, AJ Styles and Rude, uh, Robert Rude's uh, rivalry. R Truth gives me 8K with no popularity loss. And we have the Boogeyman versus Roddy Roddy Piper in a submission match for the NXT Championship. I mean, Eric literally made it so that he couldn't fucking win, and it was a five-star match. And Boogeyman retains the title before losing it whenever he leaves the company next week. Cedric Alexander versus Shanky in a TLC match. Cedric Alexander wins, and their rivalry grows. Kishi does a self-promo for two popularity. We got Matt Riddle versus Finn Balor. Matt Riddle wins, of course. Uh, Rhea Ripley calls out Cora Jade for a rivalry. We have Battleship Brittany versus Gigi Dolan in a tables match for the SmackDown Women's Championship. Battleship Brittany retains. End of statement. Cora Jade does a charity promo of 3750 fans. The Ultimate Warrior vs. MVP in, in in a tables match. Blah, 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 blah. MVP wins. And they get a rivalry. Then Drew McIntyre vs. Trompa in a backstage brawl for the Universal Championship. And Ciampa wins the championship. We got Shinsuke vs. Seth Rick and Rollins in an Extreme Rules match. Not for the title or anything, just facing each other off. The rivalry goes level 2. Johnny Gargano gets 6k fans for charity. Heath Manhattan vs. Umaga. Heath Manhattan wins. And Umaga gets injured for 3 weeks. Umaga is the most injured legend. Charlotte Flair calls out Carolina Reaper for nothing. Angel vs. Kane. Kane wins. The rivalry goes level 2. We have Ivar calling out Johnny Gargano for level 1 rivalry. Then we have Kevin Nash versus Apollo Crews. One, two, and Kevin Nash wins, and Apollo Crews gets injured for 3 weeks, of course. Carolina Reaper does a uh, self-promo for 4 popularity. Damn! And then Rey Mysterio versus the Red Flame in a backstage brawl match. Rey Mysterio wins, and their rivalry regress level 2. We have Randy Orton vs. Julius Creed in a TLC match. One, two, ring the bell. 
Julius Creed wins. And that ends the rivalry. Bailey does a self promo for three popularity. Diesel versus Eddie Guerrero. Eddie wins. They get a rivalry. Miz versus Braun Strowman for the WCW World Heavyweight Championship. And Braun Strowman is the new WCW World Heavyweight Champion. And they have a rivalry. We have Cody Rhodes and Ilya Dragunov versus T Bar and Jimmy Uso. Uh, they're not putting the titles on the line, though, because why would they put the titles on the line at a pay per view? Or a PLE? There's no reason to. They have Ali Brawler versus Asuka in a Falls Count Anywhere match for the Women's Championship. And it's a five star match. Well, I had amazing booking. There were four five star matches, and Raw did not have a single one. We got no injuries on SmackDown, we got two injuries on Raw, and we got no injuries on WCW. This seems to be, like, the least injury season so far. Not that there aren't injuries, just that there have been less than normal. Okay. I have more than a 300,000 fan lead now. I have less money than Raw. <laughs> and because two people use a star on me, Becky Lynch still cannot participate. Coming up next time. See ya.